Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo, and welcome back to Shadowverse. Last time we uh, defeated... Oh, I can't remember his name was. I don't want to call him just Count Dracula. But, um... Ah, uh, I don't remember his name. Does it have, like, an update as to who she beat? Does it, does it tell us? No. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, I'm sure we'll hear his name again. I don't think we've seen the last of him. But now we're on the next chapter, Chapter 3, Resonance. Concerned that the awakened Urias, okay, that was his name, might harm the princess, Erika has decided to return to the castle. Okay, so we're headed back to the castle. Still gotta use the default deck, but uh, possibly at the end of this episode I might just, uh, unlock some of the cards and... Ooh, that sounds like one of the enemies. Where have you taken Losaria? That shout! Hmm. Ah, this is Someone's another one of the being characters. Attacked. Are you hurt? I'm moving in. She's looking for her friend. No, I'm fine. What was that? They changed shape. But they're no match for me. Aha! You take that one. Her storyline is one of the first chapters that you unlock, but I didn't know whether or not I should start with it because since I already made it to chapter 8, you know, players watching would have missed uh, her whole storyline. Well, they would have missed the opening cutscene, but I could have redone the storyline. No problem. You must die! Never see her again. Hmm. Cards I want to redraw. Ooh, I'm gonna have to redraw both you. And you, five turn cards. Okay, Oathless Knight and uh, and Goliath. There's also a few little neat things you can do on the field. Like you can mess with stuff. And sometimes it does cool stuff like that. Doesn't look like I can play anything this turn, so we're gonna end and let her go. But it shouldn't be too tough. I think Don't I Lasaria. So sorry. All my fault. And of course, that's just a shade. Even though it looks like her, it's just a shadow. It's not the real her. Oathless Knight. 3-3, three, three, summon a knight. Perfect. Go on, I want to brother. be careful about attacking that, uh, At your service. water fairy. Yep. Last words. Put a fairy into your hand. When she dies, she'll summon another fairy, so I want to be careful about that. She's probably going to attack with a living way because she wants a fairy. Yep. So this is my end. They find us all! Aha! Now I draw, and I get Fighter, Forge Weaponry, and Unbridled Fury. We're gonna go with Fighter, I and live by the sword! We'll probably, we'll probably be able to use Forge Weaponry in the next turn, maybe on the Goliath. No one gets now, past me! We can go straight through to her life points, because she doesn't have anything with, uh, How much is in it for me? Field. I lost one, but that's okay. Eccentric Knight, Goliath, Unbridled Fury. Uh, oh, he summons a knight, doesn't he? Yes. Perfect. My allies, my friends. Lovely day for a fight. Two two. She's a one two. I'm gonna go straight. Take through. that. Ah. Hey, that rhymed. Then in turn, all right. We're doing great. Look after the others. And I believe I get. Yes, I get evolve the next turn. Let's play. Not bad. Hey, let's play. Hey, let's play. Ooh, that's a lot of players. And if you're wondering, uh, I'm doing these in batch recordings. You know, most of them on the same day because I'm getting ready to go for the work week. Uh, it's uh, it's been the weekend, so so I try to get as much as I can, as much done as I can during the weekend. Oh, what the heck are you? Okay, back to the hand. We're looking at ooh, white general. Give plus two plus zero to an ally officer follower. That would be him and then forge weaponry, but I can't do both. So let's do... Can I give give plus one plus two, one to all other allied followers? I should do him this turn and then him next turn. Yes. White general. We'll use that Raise your weapon. blade! Right. Oh, but it doesn't give him attack. Uh, but she's just got a bunch of small creatures, so we don't have to worry about that. Come get some! Go straight ah, through. Take that! 
Apparently, ah. her deck's not, this deck, that deck is not made for defense. It's got a lot of small creatures out there, but it doesn't have anything with ward on it to stop me from attacking directly through it. Thinking. Hmm. Whoa. The order will remain. Um, well, I knew something. Wait, that's I'm it. Taking some damage here. Ah. Ooh, dang. Okay, but I can evolve this turn, so things are going to turn around and go my way. Let's see what we can do. We can summon a knight, and then that'll put us at from one, two, we've got six, that'll put us at four. Then we'll have enough for forge weaponry. Uh, let's see, or unbridled fury. What about this guy? Give plus one, plus, plus one to all other allied followers. There's nobody out there uh, right then, but it does activate for more than just one turn. If I evolve him, he'll go to 3-3, three, three, but he won't do anything special. 6-8, but he doesn't do anything special. So... We're going to go with Sage Commander. 6-8. Then we're probably going to want to evolve him. You are done for! Boom! Victory in sight! Just as planned. Can't attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just because he, he just got summoned. So should I... Should I hit? Uh, She can go right through me, so I should probably hit. Just as planned. Her sacred forest. All right. So that's going to bring her down to two fairies left. Come on, let's talk play. To her. She's still got plenty of cards in her hand. But it doesn't look like she's going to be able to turn this around. At least not with two lives. There's a follower of board and six health. Never Ooh, uh, okay, I never worked enough. Luminescence! That's gonna be a problem. Oh, You're backfired. that's a big problem. Backfiring. No, mm, we don't like that. What can we do? We've got Oathless Knight, Summon the Knight, Forge Mastery. I need to use Unbridled Fury to destroy the Angelic Sword Maiden after I summon Oathless Knight, because then he can summon a knight with his fanfare. So summon a knight, Go on, brother. using his fanfare ability, At your service. then activate Unbridled Fury, and deal the two damage to her uh, My follower Lord. of ward. And then, we can give one of them the forge weaponry, or we can just give it to our Goliath next turn. How so much is in it for me? Her. And we'll save the evolution for either a rare card or a Goliath. Okay, we got this now. So this. I'll get you out in a jiffy. I'll go right through that. Cards. Messiah. Yeah, you can evolve it if you want, but you don't have anything to do with it, so I'm gonna go right through it. This wasn't worth it. All right, here we go. So we've got the Goliath. And I'm going to give him Forge Weaponry. So now he becomes stronger. Then we can evolve him to make him stronger. It won't be again. long now. Five, six. Wait a minute. Can I make this Forge right? Stronger! Hang on. For evolved is five, six. Okay, so we, I didn't overwrite his Forge Weaponry ability. That's important to note. So I can go straight through for two, or straight through for one. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Yeah, he was just some so he can't attack those ones, so... No one gets past me! You go through the one. Ah. And you can destroy the five and take the... You can destroy the five and take five and you'll be down to three. Uh, I don't want her... She's got one evolution left. I probably don't want her to evolve it and do a damage to me. Uh, I should probably just hit this then. We'll make it next time! Yeah, that should be okay. Okay, so she's got another Goliath, she can, ward, she can evolve that one. But I've still got my Goliath in a lot of turns. Haha, <laughs> douche move. Douche move time. <laughs> Even stronger now. Oh, she has nothing with ward. This is overkill. Wait, 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 wait. Way overkill. Way overkill. Another Goliath. <laughs> Lasaria. So sorry. Oh Victory! Alright. Nice. The pleasure was all mine. Excellent. 20 rupees rewarded. Next. Sweet. 
pretty soon we'll start getting into the actual challenging matches with a lot of the uh, you know cooler enemies, cooler cards, decks, and that unlocking was us, new packs. Wasn't it? It'll be awesome. They seemed like exact copies. Yeah. I'm Arisa. I'm sorry, you are? Oh, it's Arisa, not Arisa. My name is Erica. Thank you, Erica. I'm really glad you were around. It's hmm. nothing. Yeah, Do you have fine. any idea what made them attack you? <laughs> Just like me, dot dot. <laughs> dot dot dot. No, I'm not really sure. But they took my best friend. No. I I'm sorry. Well, now you know. I'm going to find her, though. As a matter of fact, I'm looking for someone, too. The princess. A friend oh. of yours? Oh, no, uh, Uriah was his name? Not exactly. But he's one of the most important things in my life right now. Oh, my. I could never let him slip away. Oh, my. It sounds like he's lucky to have someone so dedicated. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Whenever I read that the first time from her storyline perspective, I had no idea. I, I was thinking the exact same thing she was. Like, you know, that's her boyfriend or husband or something. And now I know. I'm sure you'll find him. It was good to meet you. Good luck. Nice. You can't run fast enough, Urias. Urias, okay, I almost had it right. Let's just try to remember Jiraiya from Naruto, Urias. You can't run fast enough. She's gonna catch up to him and stab him in the butt. <laughs> New chapter unlocked. All right. Let's see, uh, uh, let's open a card pack. That'll be fun to end the episode out on. We'll go back and open up a card pack. So first we're gonna wanna go to home, and then that takes you to the home page, and then you go, where is it? Da, 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 da. Oh no, my face cam's in the way. No! I can't, wait, I can still do buy crystals, buy cards, buy supplies, cards. Decks. I can still. I can still. Can I still. Cards? I can still unlock cards? I can still liquefy cards? Huh. Okay. Home. So, should I just sort of. click? What is this? Items? Wonderland Dreams card pack. Ticket. Times 10. From the Shadowverse team. Ooh, good. Expires in never. I love that. <laughs> Wonderland Dreams. That's one of the expansion packs that adds new cards and new characters to the game. It's really cool. I haven't gotten to see it yet, though, but I've seen previews and it looks really nice. Up to 100 items can be claimed at once. Unclaimed items disappear after the indicated date. That one never disappeared, so I'm good with that. All items have been claimed. Sweet. Sorry if I talk so fast. <laughs> so that's info... Maybe this one? Type your birth year and month into the text box below. The number of crystals you can buy depends on your age? What? Info, missions, friends. Evolve. Uh, so it's not that one. that one huh hang on let me I, I got it I'll pause the recording okay I finally figured out how to get to the card buy screen I'm gonna have to splice that but I have one ticket for the standard card packs I have 11 tickets for the Wonderland Dreams expansion and I, I, ah that's a good idea I'll show you all of the expansions here remember I'm I'm new to this Wonderland Dreams You've got your standard. You've got your Darkness Evolved expansion. And again, this is um, newest is at the top. So Wonderland Dreams just dropped recently. So we're going to go newest to oldest. Uh, Darkness Evolved. Those are some pretty cool looking cards. I've got 10 tickets. And with each ticket, a pack contains 8 cards plus one possible silver legendary card. Then we've got Rise of Bahamut. Those are pretty cool. Very nice, very nice. And I've got 18 tickets of those. I didn't buy these, by the way. Most of these are login rewards and uh, gifts that the developers of the game actually give you just for playing and logging in. So 
that's another shout out to the devs. You know, they did a great job with um, incentive. They did good with giving players good incentive. So if you want to check it out, be my guest. I mean, heck, it's, it's a good game. And then finally, in the last, I guess the first expansion, we have Tempest of the Gods. So that looks pretty cool, and those are really interesting cards, and I've got 17 tickets for those. And it, each ticket gives you one pack, so I've got <laughs> plenty to unlock. But for now, since we're on the standard storyline, I guess we'll stick to the uh, standard pack. So I'm going to use the one ticket I have right here for the standard card pack, and I'm going to go on ahead and reveal that. And you can auto-reveal the cards immediately after you unlock them, uh, but I don't like to do that because I like the suspense of click and then it's, you know, it flips around and it shows you the new card you just got, so I really like that. There's also a series of rupees, um, which I think you get those from daily logins, and then crystals you buy with cash. So, but I really don't feel like it's a pay-to-win game. You know, you can play online against your friends, but with the card games, there's a lot of knowledge and strategy and counter-building involved that, you know, keeps it away from being too much of a pay-to-win game, you know? You gotta think what you hit. So, let's buy that pack. Tickets, one needed. Confirm. <sighs> Gonna get some new cards. That was terrible. I shouldn't... I look crazy when I smile like that. It's terrible. Yay! Auto reveal. Oh, and it slowly opens. And the cards flip out like that. That's so cool. And then you just click and drag. And there's my rare. We got Dulahan. Evolve, gain four shadows. Woo. So once you evolve him, you gain uh, shadow followers. <laughs> Dang, and that's what it sounds like. Ooh, wow. There's a lot of different sound effects to these. Okay, so that's another thing I can do. I can preview the sound effects and everything. So we've got Sacred Plea. Uh, let's see. The effect is countdown, three, last words, draw two cards, hmm, amulet, oh, okay, I think the way that works is you, once you have that number of turns, you play the card, then it counts down from the number of turns it has, so once it hits the field, it starts counting down, and when it hits zero, it's destroyed, and when it's destroyed, you draw two cards, or when it's destroyed, you get the effect. So then we've got ethereal form. Give an allied follower the ability to ignore ward. Necromancy. Four. Give plus two, plus zero to that follower. Huh. Now, I'm not sure about the necromancy trait. Uh, I think that's something to do with how many cards are in your graveyard at the time. Like, once it's active, it's active, as long as that many cards remain in your grave. Oh, there you go. Oh, it's shadows. If you have enough shadows, they're automatically spent to activate the necromancy effect of a card. This can happen when they're played, evolved using an evolution point, or under other specific conditions. Much better than my explanation. Okay, now we've got Guilty Courier. Oh, he looks cool. Whenever another allied follower is destroyed, gain plus one plus zero. Evolved. Whenever another allied follower is destroyed, gain plus one plus zero. Hmm, that's pretty cool. I used to have a card like that, except uh, instead of gaining... Instead of gaining strength, it, it dealt damage to the ally. Oh, it's a rare version of him. Oh, these, the hollow, the holographic ones do the same thing, but they're hollow. And the cool thing about uh, CCG, uh, the collectible card games on the PC, is that, you know, they can be animated. <laughs> so that's cool. So then we've got power of protection. Give plus one, plus zero, and war to an allied follower. Nice. Uh, ward, you know, uh, same as usual, means that that creature has to be attacked first. And then we've got Blood Wolf. Ooh, nice claws. They look molten. Uh, okay, Storm, Fanfare, deal two damage to your leader. Storm, okay, Storm is what? Followers that have Storm can attack on the same turn they're played. Okay, so it's like haste. Sorry if I use Magic the Gathering terms. I'm a, I'm a magic nerd, so just Storm is haste. No, storm is storm, but it's it's like haste. <laughs> Sorry. Fanfare. Effects activate when you play the card from your hand using play points. Okay. Okay. So then we've got... Oh! And I can preview what its uh, evolved form looks like. Okay, I gotta go back and do that for everybody. Sorry if this takes a while, but 
Some people like card reveals. Zernitra, Zernetra. I mean, if I'm not, I want to do the card reveals and the deck reveals, you know, like when you open packs up and everything. And, you know, when you show what the evolved forms look like. Because I feel like that's the whole game and I want to give you the whole experience. Storm and Fanfare. Summon a dragon. Okay. Dragon is 5 play point follower. It's a 5-5 five five and evolved it's a 7-7. Seven seven. Okay. Nice. And her evolved form looks like... Nice. Looks like she's got some dragons riding along right with her. Okay. Very nice. So, let's check out what everyone's evolved forms look like. Ooh, dang. Check out the zombies on the sides. That's nice. And of course, I'm sorry if I don't, you know, stick on the screen for long enough with the evolutions. If you want to see it for a little bit longer, you know, you can pause or anything. I don't want to hold you up. And we're going with... Oh, I love his hat. And his little lantern. So cool. And he's like summoning spells. That is crazy. Oh, what does the holographic one look like? I should have checked that one instead. Woo! Check this thing out. It's like, it's like mesmerizing. It just. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay, that one's. I thought that was a creature card. This one's a creature card. We saw him and we saw her, I believe. Yeah. Got. got oh. You are free, my darlings. Ha! Huh? Soar! Did she say anything in her evolved form? Witness the unstoppable dragon. Oh, that's awesome. Witness the unstoppable dragon. All right. How about you, buddy? All souls are equal. Rest in peace. Nice. You say anything different in your evolved form? All souls are equal. Okay, so holographic form says the same stuff evolved? You're safe with me. You're safe with me. You're safe with me. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. You're safe with me. Hang on, hang on, hang on. You're safe with me. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, well, that was the card pack we had just unlocked. So, <laughs> that was pretty fun. We're going to go back and, I guess, exit out on the homepage. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Homepage. All right. So... There's plenty more packs to unlock, plenty more opponents to defeat, and plenty more cards to be had. So, thanks everybody for joining me, and until next time, take it easy my friends. <laughs>